the latest on that deadly wrong way crash in I-91 early this morning. Hello and thanks so much for joining us here on Western Mass News at 5 o'clock. I'm Mary Wilson. That crash in Windsor, Connecticut claimed the lives of two people from East Long Meadow. Western Mass News reporter Kristen Burnell joins us live now with the latest. Kristen. Mary, we have learned that the two 25-year-olds who died attended East Long Meadow High School. We also spoke with Connecticut State Police who shared the circumstances of the fatal accident, which remains under investigation. On Thursday, just over the state line in Connecticut, a horrifying two-car crash claimed the lives of two 25-year-olds from East Long Meadow. Connecticut State Police Sergeant Christine Jautima tells Western Mass News the details surrounding that accident. On 91 northbound, uh, Troop H in Hartford received numerous 911 calls of a vehicle that was traveling southbound in the northbound lanes. Um, that was around 1230 this morning and shortly thereafter, uh, Troop H was notified that that vehicle was involved in a head-on collision with a tractor trailer. The victims were identified as 25-year-olds Dominique Lazell of Brighton, Massachusetts and James Bowen of East Long Meadow. Both of them in the same vehicle that was driving south on I-91 on the northbound side, the wrong direction when they hit a tractor trailer heading north. We've obtained this dash cam video taken a short time before the crash, showing the car driving in the wrong direction. The two individuals that were involved in the wrong way that were in the car, the driver and the passenger, both died at the scene um, upon impact. Um, our troopers responded and the highway was shut down for numerous hours uh, to uh, conduct the investigation. We've learned Lizelle and Bowen both graduated from East Long Meadow High School in 2015. Frank Page, the principal of East Long Meadow High School, shared a statement with Western Mass News on Friday saying in part, quote, I am so sad to learn about the tragic loss of Dominique and James. I remember both fondly from their years at ELHS. Dominique was a model and caring student who was respected by staff and peers. James was a vibrant and friendly student who lit up any room that he walked into. The entire Spartan community has both of their families in our thoughts and prayers. And Sergeant Deltima tells us they are urging people to be more careful on the roads. We are encouraging people, if they are driving out on the roads at night between 11 p.m. 3 a.m., to stay in that right lane of the highway. Wrong way drivers tend to utilize the left lane thinking that it is the right lane and also to be mindful, watch their surroundings, stay off their phones um, and just be aware of what's going on. Connecticut State Police tell us that the crash remains under investigation. Reporting live in studio, Kristen Burnell, Western Mass.